So in this video, we are going to see how to create efficient looking charts. Charts are the important tool which is used to analyze and understand any data. I've taken the data of cash flow of ITC where we have the net cash flows from three different activities. And then we have calculated the net increase, decrease in, ca in cash and cash equivalents. So I've plotted these net increase and decrease in cash and cash equivalents on my chart over here. So we have negative and positive values both. The negative values are represented in red, whereas the positive values are represented in green. Also, the highest value, the highest increase or decrease which is obviously increase in cash and cash equivalence is represented in a darker color or dark green color. All this editing which I have done, I'll show you all in this and my coming video. So let us just begin. We have the same data over here. Let me select the dates column and this last column which we have. In the insert tab, we'll select the 2D bar chart. The very first thing will be to change the chart title which we have. So we'll edit the chart title. Let me just select this entire thing, copy the entire title and paste it over here. We've pasted the chart title. We can decrease the size of the uh, title a bit. So it looks fine. Okay, the next thing which we are going to do is to remove the horizontal axis over here, which is not required. So I'll select and remove the horizontal axis. Once I remove the axis, I can add the data labels over here beside the bar charts. So I'll just simply right click on the bar chart and click on add data labels. So we have the data labels now. The next thing is the vertical axis, which you see the vertical grid lines are not required. So I'll just remove the vertical grid lines. Then uh, we have the vertical axis, which is a little different from the data over here. These are in March. Over here, we have it in case of January. Now, how to change this and why this is happening? We will just simply click on this, right click, format axis. And in this, you can see the bounds are 1st January 2015 to 1st January 2019. And so we are not getting the dates or the data, which is exactly similar to our to that of in our table. How to change this? We'll click on the text axis and it changes to the exact same what we have in our table. Now, one more thing, suppose if you want this to reverse and you want to show the March 19 data on top, whereas March 15 data on the very bottom, you can do this by simply clicking on, again, the same thing, access options in here, we'll click on categories in reverse order. So we'll just simply click on the categories in reverse order and you can see the categories changes entirely and we have March 19 to March 15. So this once this is done, what we can do, we can just format this a bit and make this bold and black in color so that it stands out a bit. The next thing is the bars. These bars look very small. So how to increase the size of this? We'll just simply right click and format data series. Over here, we have in the series options, uh, the gap width, we can reduce the gap width between each of the bars which we have. So we let just, just uh, reduce it and we have nice big looking bars, right? After this, the next thing which we want is the negative values to be shown in red and the positive values should be shown in green. So this we can just simply go to fill series options, fill. And in this fill, we have something as invert if negative. So we'll click on this invert if negative and you can see the negative values are now blank. In order to change this, first of all, we'll change the color. This is the positive fill color, the fill color of positive values. We'll click on this and we'll select the light green color from here. And you can see the positive values has been changed in green. The negative values which we have, we can simply change this into red by using the second option which appears this will only appear if you click on the invert if negative option so this all editing has been done the next thing which we want is to change is to remove the chart border which you see over here to exactly look similar to this chart which we have so let me just decrease the size a bit of our charts 
plot area and move the title to the very center and now in order to remove the border what we can do is we can simply click on the chart in the format section over here we'll click on shape fill in this we'll click on no fill the no fill will remove the fill which we have basically which was white in color earlier and you can now see the entire logo over here so it removes the fill the shape outline which we do not want we'll just click on no outline and you see now a chart type chart area does not have any border to it so this is how we have created a chart wherein we have the negative values with red the positive values in green to highlight the positive the highest value in a dark green color we'll check this out in our next video thank you this is it for our this video